how does drinking water make its journey to your home in Lethbridge? This video will help to answer this question. Where does the water from our tap come from? Lethbridge is the largest city located within the Old Man watershed. The Old Man River is our main source of water. The water from the Old Man River enters the water treatment plant and goes through a series of processes including screening, coagulation, clarification, filtration, UV disinfection, and is then distributed to over 100,000 customers. Lethbridge, Coaldale, Colhurst, Picture Butte, and hamlets and acreages within the Lethbridge County. The Lethbridge Water Treatment Plant is located in the Old Man River Valley and treats an average 50 megaliters of water each day. The water treatment plant ensures the water goes through these processes to eliminate any harmful bacteria or materials in the river water. Once it leaves the water treatment plant, it is healthy, clean, and safe to drink right from the tap. Let's get started so we can understand how Lethbridge water is treated and the process it takes from the Old Man River to our taps. The water begins its journey into the water treatment plant from the Old Man River, passing through screens, removing larger items from the water, before continuing on to the treatment process. After screening, low lift pumps push the water into the water treatment plant And then, the water continues its journey through mixers, allowing for coagulation to occur. Coagulation is the addition of approved water treatment chemicals to convert microscopic particles and other contaminants into larger and heavier particles. The water continues on and enters the clarifiers, which are settling tanks that use sedimentation, a process removing the majority of the larger particles by settling them in the tanks. Carbon is added during the clarification process to control taste, odor, and color. Clear water is drawn off the top of the clarifiers, where it then has chlorine added after the sedimentation process. Chlorine disinfects the water so that it is safe for drinking. Chlorine destroys microorganisms such as bacteria and viruses in the water, which can pose a threat to public health. It is added within limits specified by the Alberta environment to ensure that it is safe for human consumption. The settled water from the clarification enters the filtration process. This removes most of the remaining particles to the point where it is too small to see using fine sand and anthracite. In this process, the clear water filters through the anthracite and sand as shown here. The filters have varying composition and pore sizes in order to help remove unwanted items in the water. The filter can be run for up to 100 hours before being washed. Particles collected in the filter are removed with a combination of air and water. Measurements are taken to ensure that all particles meet regulations and guidelines set by Alberta Environment. The water enters the ultraviolet or UV disinfection process to protect public health from disease-causing organisms that can be found in the water. Before leaving the water treatment plant, the chlorine in the water is combined with ammonia to form chloramine. This reduces the formation of disinfection byproducts and ensures a long-lasting protection against bacteria and other organisms on its journey to your tap. Tests are performed throughout the process to ensure that the drinking water you receive in your homes and businesses is safe and reliable. The water is then pumped to six storage reservoirs through high-lift pumps. There are two storage reservoirs located in the north, two located in the south, and two located in the west of Lethbridge. Water is then pumped again into the distribution system of the underground pipes and sent off to homes and businesses. This is the journey of Lethbridge tap water from the Old Man River through the water treatment plant to your tap.